Why do I do this to myself knowing how easily creeped out I get? Hello beautiful people, I hope you are doing well and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today I am bringing you guys another review and as you can see by the title, today we are reviewing Parasite the Grey. Let's get started. don't know parasite the gray is basically about these parasites that come onto the earth they infiltrate the earth they take over people's bodies they find themselves a little host and they take over their bodies and they go around wreaking havoc <laughs> throughout the country killing people right this is where our main character comes in so suing jong suing if i remember correctly is her name um so she is one of the Vi victims? Are they called victims? <laughs> of the parasites take over her body but due to certain circumstances she does not change all the way right so she becomes mutant and this kind of puts a target on her back because the humans are after her the parasites are after her because she is all and none at the same time and that basically kickstarts the entire show and we just always see the battle between humans versus parasites with jokes of wind kind of sort of stuck in the middle so if you are a fan of shows like Squid Game, All of Us Are Dead, Happiness, you know, those gory, creepy kind of shows, then drop everything and go watch this one. <laughs> and there's also a deeper story there with um, Jung Soo-in and her life because she's had a pretty tough life. Oh, she's had a pretty tough life, okay, pretty traumatic life. So we see a bit of that to glimpse into that and also her, her little wingman, right hand man, <laughs> what's his name? Kwang, guys, I've forgotten the names, so you will be strong. But like the little, you know him, and they've basically gone through a lot in life, and they continue to go through a lot, um, even throughout the duration of the series. And we just see how they back each other up. They are there for each other. They help each other through everything. And of course, the parasite is also they coming through to help whenever it can. You know, Miss Heidi shows up when she needs to. <laughs> Plus, it's only six episodes. So guys, like. Watch it. It's nice. It's creepy. It's creepy. Um, coming from someone who's easily creeped out. Um, it's creepy. Don't be like me and watch it at night if you are easily creeped out because you will have nightmares. So guys, they really didn't come to play. Hey, like they did not come to play in the shock factor. I mean, scene number one, episode one. They are like, we are going to shock you. Okay, because I was not ready when the little EDM party was happening, going on, and then there was that guy passed out, you know, in the bed. I'm guessing there was like the VIP lounge or whatever. And then that's when we first see the the parasites in action because the one parasite comes in, takes over, and Muntu goes over there, goes over to where everybody's uns 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 uns, and starts wreaking havoc. I was like. And then, as if that wasn't shocking enough, here comes this crazy lunatic guy who tries to murder <laughs> the poor girl who tries to murder Jong Soo in over meat. No, because these parasites are creepy, guys. Hey, like I can't be the only one that was completely creeped out every time they opened their faces and started attacking people. Now, at some point, it gets comedic. <laughs> like if the fight goes on long enough, especially when it's a fight between one of the parasites and Heidi, and they're going at it, and they just swing in their faces around, <laughs> it gets comedic at some point. But if it's a quick, fast, fast little, ah, oh, that was creepy. That was creepy. That's why I said in my little TikTok, could see I clip hands for the editing team because I still cannot figure out how they did that. <laughs> and yo guys, Jim the detective, hey, I really felt for the detective. Like when when he got decapitated, I was like, but like that whole scene was so quick. I can't be the only one who was just like, whoa, wait a second, what just happened? I had to rewind. I had to rewind and be like, did did, did this dude's head just get chopped off right before our eyes? Like what? And that snake of a police officer who was working for the parasites, I'm like, then he wants to turn over to the good guys towards the end. I'm like, ah, so it's a bit too late. Mm. Um, and speaking of police officers, that lady, the lady officer, she done stressed me out because especially when um Jung Soo Win was telling and, and the other guy Kong when they were calling her up, telling her what's what, right? And they were giving her the information and she was just not leaving the poor people. I'm like, ma'am. City said, Zam Zami, they are trying to give you some information here and you just don't want to take it. Why? Because it's coming from someone who's part 
better side. It really stressed me out how this lady is, is she's painted as you know top of the top she knows what to do she knows how to do her job like uh, uh, uh. and yet it's like ma'am why are your instincts not breaking also not these parasites forming a whole little church it's basically a cult i'm not them forming a whole and i'm like i saw the gun because this was similar to that i'm like y'all better leave the church alone you better leave the church out of this please and thank you but can i just say that heidi was the mvp okay I absolutely love, love, loved Heidi because you just knew Goody Heidi is going to be sitting there. I just pictured, I don't know why, I just pictured Heidi like the parasite just chinchilling on a chair, just watching everything pan out, and she's like, I'm going to wait, I'm going to save my energy. I loved Heidi, no, she was the MVP, she was the MVP. I think my favorite scene of Heidi approaching or showing herself doing the most saving the day was when was when Kwangu was hanging over the clip on the car and then and then and then John Suwin was like hold on to my hand hold on to my hand and you know they were just too far they couldn't reach they couldn't reach and then they were like and, you know the car fall through the car fall through we're like oh homeboy is dead and the camera pans and we see Heidi had done a pit and then grabbed and was like you ain't about to die right now sir not on my watch <laughs> I'm a Heidi stan through and through like I'm a miss Heidi that is who I'm going to miss. <laughs> and this is why, this is why it frustrated me when I saw the police officer not listening to what was being told to her, right? Because it's like, if I was that lady, if I was that lady, I would have recruited, <laughs> I would have recruited John Stowin and Heidi because it's like, I think you guys might come in handy. Now, at the end, of course, we do get that little revelation when Kong is like, he got recruited, you know, into the task force or whatever you want to call it. And he was like, well, she said, if you want to pull through, you're most welcome, there's room for you. And I was like, you should have done that in the first place um, because Heidi is MVP. <laughs> And y'all, speaking of Heidi, so you know how um Kwangu shows through and well he put it, it, like the final 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 scene um when I think they're at the harbor or something and Kwangu comes through and he's like yo here's the letter from Heidi and gives the letter to Jong Su in right and they're reading the letter and whatever and I'm just like is this like the end of of Heidi? Hmm, I feel like I need to go watch that scene maybe i missed something i need to go rewatch it because i'm like is this the end of heidi like is heidi gone did she just peace out like what's happening because i'm, a, I'm a, i like i like the thing <laughs> like i like heidi so it's like if 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 that is really you know like the end of the road i'm gonna be sad i'm gonna be sad because heidi was there to save the day every single time but no the show was good guys hey the show was good. No, it was moving. Now I know I'm going to be paranoid for like the next maybe two weeks. I'm going to be walking around the streets on some. Now, are you human or? <laughs> oh my god, it was so good. It was so good. I really enjoyed it. Oh, uh, you know, apart from all the shock. I mean, the shock definitely adds to the excitement and entertainment, does it not? Um, so yeah, and also I know that it is a manga, right? It's based on a manga and apparently the manga was turned into an animation before the K-drama became a thing. So i'm thinking maybe if i have time i can go watch the anime because what i will not do is read the manga <laughs> she is not a reader so i don't know if i would read the manga i wouldn't even know where to begin looking for it even maybe if i have time i'll go watch the anime just to see how different how close is it to the k-drama you know maybe there are some details there that are not in the k-drama those type of things you know so we can weigh weigh things out um so yeah i think that is it you let me know what you thought of the show because for me it's it's a it's a good nine <laughs> i'm terrible at rankings so there's also that but maybe like a young nine out of ten I don't know. um so you will let me know what you thought of it as well and if you had you know some some oh english <laughs> what's the word i'm looking for but if you you know if there are some things you didn't like let me know if you still have some questions. Write them down. You know, let's have let's let's broaden this 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 conversation further than just on the screen. Let us dive into the comment section. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, that is it from me to you for now. So until we see each other once again, don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment, switch on post notifications, all that amazing stuff. Until next time, stay amazing. Bye. I don't know what that is, but bye. <laughs>